So we're having two sessions this year around food supply chains, one on China's food supply chains and the other around the global coal chain. Why is this a topic of interest this year? Uh, first on the subject of China. China is a very interesting case because as we all know, China is a very um, tech uh, savvy uh, market. Uh, they've used the internet and um, smartphones and uh, tech in a way that permits them to leapfrog a lot of things, not just uh, mobile phones, but also um, the distribution network for a lot of things, including food. And so that panel is going to dissect what China has done right, maybe what it's done wrong in this sector, but clearly China's made a lot of progress and there's a lot of things in the food supply chain in China that are worth looking at. With respect to the cold storage chain, that's a subject which has been neglected too long, but is extremely important, especially in this day and age, because we're all concerned about climate change, right? And if we get the cold storage chain right, it's going to definitely improve our chances of uh, overcoming the climate change challenge. Uh, we're going to have a much more efficient uh, distribution network. Um, it's going to reduce uh, food waste significantly. There are a lot of big players in this sector that are doing a lot of interesting things that we have not heard much about yet, at least not in public discussion. So I think that this is a, a, a panel which will, I think, open some eyes.